Hey guys, hope you're having a great day. Before I start the video, I just want to give a big thank you to every single one of you for helping me reach 4,000 subscribers. It's a big milestone for me and, um, you know, thank you so much. If you could also help me um, by watching uh, my videos for a little longer, as you can see here, I'm still not uh, getting paid to make YouTube videos, uh, but if I reach uh, 3,000 view hours, uh, public watch hours, then I'll be able to apply and I'll be eligible to, to start getting paid. In this one you need 3,000, and this one you need 4,000. But uh, getting into the video, I wanted to discuss uh, artificial intelligence and cybersecurity, right? And to be more specific, I wanted to focus on what type of what job is going to be safe from AI, because we know many people are losing their job in, in my company. I know the uh, contact center; half of the employees were let go, and this was not even recent. Uh, we're talking about maybe a year ago. Uh, they implemented an AI, and a few months later, they just let go of half of them, right? And uh, I'm also seeing that trend in for developers. I made a video about that, and a lot of people didn't agree with me. Some people did, but junior developers are not getting hired, you know. Um, I, I think there's a reduction of about 80% or even more. Um, and now with the O3 model, I'm 100% sure that mid-level developers are also going to start having some issues uh, with job opportunities. But what about cybersecurity? Um, is it going to have the same impact? Uh, is AI going to have the same impact as it's having with these other jobs? Well, I don't think so. I think cybersecurity is going to continue growing. I think this is one of the fields that is safe from AI. If anything, AI is going to help uh, cybersecurity analysts or professionals be better at their job. It's going to be a great tool, but I, I cannot see a company implementing uh, an AI and then not having a cybersecurity team. You know, that's, that's insane to me uh, because if there is a data breach, if somebody hacks into the system, they want to have uh, somebody there. There has to be a face uh, there has to be a person to respond and and give uh, management and, and the higher-ups an answer of what happened, right? You cannot ch just have AI do all the work. You got to have a face uh, taking care of, of your systems. You got to have somebody responsible. So cybersecurity, if you're looking for one field in IT that's not going to go away in the next 20 to 30 years, uh, it's definitely cybersecurity. And, and if anything, I think this is going to be here for even more than 30 years, right? I don't think it's ever going to go away because it's so important. And if you look at um, in the U.S. Bureau of Labor Statistics and you look at information security analysts, uh, not only do they make a good paycheck, but there's also a good outlook, right? It says here it's going to be growing 33%, uh, which is much faster than the average, right? You guys can see here, 33%. And if you look at the job outlook, it's saying that there's about 17,300 opens for information security analysts are projected for every single year, which is a great amount, right? So if you're in the IT field, um, and you're thinking, you've been thinking the past few years, okay, you know, where, where can I work that's going to be safe from AI? Uh, definitely, you know, cybersecurity, in my opinion, is the place to go. Now, if you're already in the IT field, um, maybe getting to a cybersecurity position might be easier for you, right? What I would personally recommend is getting the CompTIA Security Plus certification which is very well known you know a lot of companies know about it but but I think this is mostly just kind of the beginning you might get a cybersecurity job as a level one analyst or something um, if you get this one the CISSP 
uh, which is also really well known. And then you might get a maybe a mid level cybersecurity job or even a you know a higher level. So these are the two certifications that I would personally recommend if you're thinking about joining the cybersecurity field. And I'm a system analyst. I'm not a security analyst. I'm not a security analyst or a cybersecurity analyst, but this is definitely something that I'm, I've been having in mind the past few months. And uh, even even when I ask uh, ChatGPT, you know, uh, to give me its opinion about about this topic, so I'll do it right now so you guys can see what it's gonna say. Let me ask it here. Uh, many jobs are being affected by AI. Uh, do you think the cyber security field will continue to grow strong? And let's see what it's going to say. It says that yes, the cyber security field is likely to continue growing strongly even as AI becomes more integrated into various industries, right? And it has many different reasons here. Um, and and I agree with these reasons, right? Uh, AI and cybersecurity. Uh, While well, AI is being used by cyber criminals to carry out more sophisticated attacks, you have like automating phishing or AI-driven malware. It's also a powerful tool for cybersecurity professionals. It can help detect uh, threat detection, behavior analysis, and responding to vulnerabilities faster than manual methods. So um, definitely AI is gonna be a great tool. Uh, this website that I was showing at the beginning is from IBM, and they're discussing here how, uh, you know, integrating AI into their cybersecurity is improving their speed, accuracy, and productivity of the security team. So um, many companies, are implementing this AI, uh, but I do not see a future. I'm going to repeat it. I do not see a future where the cybersecurity team is going to get let go. In my company, um, you know, they, they're still hiring senior level cybersecurity, mid level cybersecurity, uh, junior level cybersecurity analysts. Everybody's getting hired there um, if they need any type of help. And uh, I did find this article. Um, that says, will AI replace cybersecurity? It says, exploring AI's evolving role in security. And and I like this article because it tells you the answer right at the beginning. The short answer is no. AI is not expected to replace cybersecurity or take secure cybersecurity jobs. It will, however, augment cybersecurity with new tools, methods, and framework, which we know. So, um... Again, you know, if you've been wondering, pondering, okay, where can I go in the IT field that's going to be safe from this AI takeover? And let's say cybersecurity is the place to go, in my humble opinion. And um, apart from these two certifications, maybe you could try to get something also cloud-based, you know, um, I'm just going to do a quick search here, AWS Security Cert, and let's see, there it is. Maybe this also will be a beneficial, AWS Security Cert, uh, Certified Security Specialty. And, um, you know, this will look good on your resume as well. Of course, this will require a lot of studying, but if you already work in the IT field, maybe, maybe you don't have to study that much, you know, maybe in a month month and a half you're able to just prepare enough and take the exam it's very expensive 300 bucks uh that's uh that's expensive but um yeah let me know what you think in the comment section below as you can see here it's projected to continue growing the next 10 years um it says here employment in 2023 for set for information security analysts was 180,000. And projected employment for 2033 is 239,000, which is a pretty large number. Um, but yeah, let me know in the comment sessions if you think there's any other jobs in the IT field that you feel might be safe from this 
AI tools being implemented. And um, yeah, thank you again for helping me reach uh, 4,000 subscribers. It's a great blessing. And again, if you have a chance, please uh, continue watching my videos and um, you know, it will help me reach those uh, public wash hours. Thank you so much and uh, have a great night.